When you think about wind energy, you may remember these beautiful wind farms. Wind is a clean source of renewable energy that causes no air or water pollution. Additionally, wind is freely available, which makes the wind energy more special. Do you know how this wind energy is converted into electrical energy? The blowing wind spins the turbine blades. A generator is connected to it. So, as the turbine spins, the generator also spins which produces electricity. But the problem here is, the blade normally spins in a very low rate. So, before connecting it to the generator, the speed is increased in the gearbox. The produced electricity passes through a transformer which steps up the voltage so that it can be transmitted on the power grid. Now, the real question is, what happens when a wind turbine retires? To know more about this, continue watching. About 85% of turbine components including steel, copper wire, electronics and gearing can be recycled or reused. But the challenge occurs in disposing the turbine blades. Why? To increase the efficiency, the blades should be lightweight. Therefore, they are made of fiberglass. But they have to be strong enough to withstand storms. So, fiberglass is combined with resin to form an extremely strong composite. This composite nature of the blade material makes separating the plastics from the fiberglass a difficult process. So, what can we do to this retired turbine blades? Is burying them the only option? Or there any new way to give our old blades a more eco-friendly ending? Necessity is the mother of inventions. Many scientists are working on this problem. You know what? The results are very interesting. It is found that old wind turbine blades could help the cement industry. That is, it can replace some of the raw materials that are the part of cement recipe. The blade's journey to cement takes few steps. First, the blade is sent to the shedding site where a powerful shedder will chop down the large blade segments into smaller chunks. Again, the smaller chunks will undergo one large shred down to pebble sized bits that cement manufacturers can mix with other materials. The best thing here is this process lowers the carbon dioxide emission by 27% compared to the traditional manufacturing process. Civil engineers from Southern Ireland are working on another amazing solution. They are building a pedestrian bridge that uses the pieces of wind turbine blades to replace traditional steel girders. Above all, researchers are spending their time and energy to build a better blade with 100% recyclable materials. If you are interested in this kind of video, don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon so that you will be notified each time I upload a video.